It's a Sunday. I was working on a Sunday, still going to high school. I was sitting there in the studio and uh, we could hear the news machine, which was down the hall. When you had a bulletin or, or any kind of important event and they wanted to get it on the air all over the news, you'd hear this ding, 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 and it would continue, and you knew something big had happened. I ran up to the machine, brought it back, read it. The Japanese have attacked the island of Oahu. And I, as a young high school student, that didn't really, you know, I didn't get the full meaning of it because that kind of thing had happened over in that part of the country in the uh, part of the world um, many times over the years and but anyway uh, I thought well we'll wait for the next bulletin to see what happened and a few minutes later well, less than five minutes another one ding 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 and this next one I think told of uh, the da part of the damage not all of it part of the damage there in the harbor and of course, in just a short time after that, one of the ships was sunk. And you know, it, it, it created the, the thing that the President Roosevelt talked about the next day. You know, we're going to have to declare war on them, and that's what they did. But it was a Sunday after, a quiet Sunday afternoon, when that first bulletin came in. And below me, high school, it didn't really mean war to me that first time that I saw that bulletin. The second bulletin, I thought, oh man, we might be going into war, you know.